Hi everyone, stock price predictions here. If you would, hit that subscribe button. And when you do, you'll be entered to win a PS5. Also, like the video and hit the notification bell so you can see it first when I post the videos. All right, hit that subscribe button. I know y'all wanna win that PS5. Also, I'm not a financial advisor, so take everything that I say with a grain of salt and only invest what you're willing to lose. Now, wow, we need to get into AMC. Do you guys see what's going on with it? It's been bad and it's been crazy. Also, let's talk about Hood. How is Hood relating to AMC? Well, AMC is for the apes. Um, obviously, Citadel and the hedge funds have been shorting the crap out of AMC illegally. And now Robinhood has its own stock. So how are all these playing against each other? Well, let's get into that and I'll give you guys some information. All right, right now AMC is trading only at $29. Very far from its high of $73. Also very far from its low of $5. But we are falling and we are falling fast with AMC, $29. It will come back up. There are still over $9 billion worth of shares that need to be covered. That's huge information. Those are FTDs, fail to deliver stocks, okay? So the hedge funds in Citadel are still illegally trading the stocks in the dark pool in the Citadel Connect, okay? So this is just so crazy what's going on with everything. AMC is down 11% today. Wow, they drove it down 11%. Now, was that being traded in a dark pool or were those people just selling their shares because they wanted to get out? Or were they selling their shares to buy Hood? Everyone was talking about not to invest in Robinhood. Well, it's going up and it's going up fast. Why is it going up? Is it the apes making it go up? Maybe there are some, but also, you know, Citadel and Robinhood are going to make this thing go to the moon. Why? Because it's their stock and they want it to go to the moon and they want to show all the apes and the AMC holders, you know, how to do it. They want to show them how to make money, so what they think. So they're going to make this price skyrocket. Okay, so AMC is down 11% today. Tomorrow we'll be on the short sell restriction list, which means they can't do their illegal shorting. On the week, AMC is down 23%. Horrible, it's so bad. We haven't had a really a green day in a, about two or three weeks. We had some small green days, up maybe 2%, 2.5%, but that is it. I think we had one or two green days in the last two to three weeks. AMC is not doing good. Then Hood comes out and it skyrockets. That's just crazy. They're doing this on purpose. They're trying to get the people, the apes, away from AMC and to get them into Hood. Obviously, that's what they're doing. On the month, AMC is down 45%. That is huge. I hope you guys are not bag holders. Remember, just hold. They still have tons, billions of fail to delivers. Now, let's just remember this. In the last three months, AMC is up 210%. That is huge. How many other stocks can get that returns? 210% in three months, that is just huge. Now in a year, AMC is up 618%. That is also huge. So remember, just hold, okay? Oh, also AMC is down 2.5% in after hours. So it'll be interesting to see how the rest of the after hours plays out and also what will happen with AMC tomorrow. I'm telling you, Hood has a lot to do with this. I know people personally, well, I know some people that actually sold some of their AMC shares, bought Hood, made money, bought back into AMC. They literally just told me that. I just got off the phone with them. So there are people going to Hood, okay? Now let's talk about Hood's numbers. Hood is up 50% today. That is huge. 50% in one day. They did drop 2.5% in the after hours. That's not bad. That still puts them at like 47.5% up on the day. So they are up 50% today. Now, since they've opened last week, I believe it was on Wednesday. So since they IPO'd, they are up 80%. That's huge in the last week to jump up 80%, but it's even bigger to come up 50% in one day. Where will that go? 
I honestly think it's going to continue to rise because it's Robin Hood. Most apes do not like Robin Hood. So they want to try to show off and show the apes a lesson. Now, despite what Robin Hood has done in the past as far as halting and freezing, GME, AMC, um, people losing a lot of money on it, um, Robin Hood does have good financials. They are one of the top brokers that are out there. Um, there's like 80% of people 25 and under, 18 to 25, are using Robin Hood. So a majority of people are using Robin Hood and signing up for Robin Hood. And they're, they are down quarter two. They've lost a lot of money. Well, they've lost a lot of money this year in general. Even though they're losing all this money, their profits are still huge. Their numbers are huge. Okay, Robin Hood is also getting hit with all kinds of fines and lawsuits. They're getting hit with like a million dollar lawsuit. That's nothing to them. That's nothing. They've got billions of dollars. So when they do this illegal stuff and they get fined a million dollars or two million dollars, another, you know, million dollars here, a million dollars there, that's not affecting them. So unfortunately, I know a lot of you all don't want to hear this, but Robin Hood is a great company and a great, you know, they just, they're making a lot of profit and they will be here for a while. So, um, as far as hood let's see what happens with that i think it's going to continue to rise and skyrocket because that's what companies want and they have a lot of control over it and they like to short other stocks and um they also like to do it illegally so since they can do it illegally it benefits them to make more money okay so back to amc there's still hope with amc okay amc is not over AMC is not over because there are a lot of FTDs failed to delivers that need to be bought back. All the synthetic shares need to be bought back and they haven't been bought back. So there's still hope for AMC. It's not going anywhere. The price is still going to rise. But there's, another, there's some bad things going on with AMC right now too, which are making some of the apes get away from AMC, which I don't like. Um, there's been at least one and I would say two to two more, so a total of three YouTubers that are saying they're going to stop talking about AMC so much or stop talking about AMC altogether. Well, they were getting taken off of YouTube for talking about AMC. Now they're saying they're going to stop talking about AMC or stop talking about them so much. So, you know, that's making apes lose hope. Um, I wish, you know, they wouldn't do that, but um, it's fine to talk about other things. That's fine, but... You know, don't say you're going to stop talking about AMC as much because we all want to see the videos. We all want to get the information that you're putting out as long as it's true. Um, a lot of these YouTube channels will pump up a stock and lie for their own benefits. Just to pump the stock up because they have money in it. Me, I'm always going to tell the truth. I'm always going to say I'm not going to do it for my own benefit. I'm going to do my own research, give you guys my honest opinions. I'm not a financial advisor, but I'm also not going to pump up any stock for any reason but to try and help you guys out, okay? All the research and data that I do and the technical, I'm trying to help you guys out. So Hood, yes, Robin Hood's a good company even though we don't like to hear it. AMC, yes, there is still hope in AMC, okay? Um, so please like this video and subscribe for your chance to win a PS5. I'll be giving away multiple PS5s after I give my first one away. All right, so if you don't win the first one, you will have a chance to win the next one. I'm gonna to continue to give these out on a regular basis because I appreciate all my supporters. All right, so remember, keep faith in AMC. All right, it's not going anywhere. It's still gonna go up. Um, just zoom out, look at the bigger picture. Yeah, we're down right now. Buy-in, it's cheap. It's gonna go back up. Also, Robinhood. I know most people don't like Robinhood. But it's a great company, um, you know, they're making lots of money and they will have good earning reports. So um, let's see what happens with Robinhood when, the, when you can start buying options and puts. I mean, I have a feeling the option volume is going to be high and it's going to drive the price up and may cause a gamma squeeze. That's what I think is going to happen. So let's come back and we'll, we'll talk about it. Let's see if I was right. But I'm predicting Robinhood to continue to go up. There will be some 
type of gamma squeeze and Robin Hood's going to go to the moon. So leave me a comment in the comment section. Let me know what y'all think about Hood. Is it going to skyrocket or is it going to crash? Also, let me know if you guys still have hope in AMC. What's your personal opinion? My personal opinion is it's still going to go to the moon because it hasn't gotten there yet and it failed to deliver. I've not all been paid and, some, and the synthetic shares need to be bought back. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll be posting another one later. Thanks to all my supporters and I hope you win that PS5.